Hello, this is Roland, Cisco Switzerland. Today I quickly wanted to show you how our um, WebEx experience is inside uh, Apple Vision Pro. So I've seen some marketing videos before and I just wanted to see how it works in real life, how it looks like. So therefore I have a Apple Vision Pro here, I uh, can play around with, with some t for some time. And yeah, so let me put it on, see how it goes. There we go. So, start the recording. I go to the right hand side and choose the WebEx application. I have all my meetings shown here on the left hand side. I would like to start a personal meeting room. Ron's personal meeting room. I join the meeting. So, I have started the meeting. I put it um, to the right hand side so whenever I look to the right hand side I basically watch the meeting so I start the recording we have uh, started the WebEx meeting and the next step would be to also see what happens when I invite people join from this device here to and I let the other 10 participants in the meeting as well we have the device on the right hand side as a meeting participant. I have the, um, the 10 participants in the meeting here. I have the option to change the layout so I can uh, focus on the actual speaker a little bit bigger and I can also change to focus so the only the speaker itself is in the meeting. So I change back to grid view because I would like to maybe focus on the participants uh, a little bit more so we have the possibility to basically pop out participants and like place them somewhere inside the meeting room so there we go I'll make us sit here I'll make it a little bit smaller there we go and then let's pop out the next participant and I'll take her and um, place her here as well They're also a little bit smaller and I'll give it a go this is a nice guy let's pop him out as well I'll put him also like a little bit higher small like this okay so I have like three participants hovering in the air over the sofa or the chair but because it is so nice I also take uh, this lady um, and pop her, pop her out and add her here as well there you go okay very good so I have now the grid view and have my participants spread across the room let, let her uh, be a little more like this and slightly bigger spread across the room <laughs> um, so I can basically talk to all of them at the same time so I can watch like how I naturally would look at the people and uh, it's yeah I, <laughs> I think it's pretty amazing so therefore, let's see what we can do with uh, these layout options. We don't want to see participants without video. And we also want to, let's say, maybe move one participant to the, to the stage. I can do that as well. So I have the active speaker on the stage and one additional person. Let's relieve her from the stage. So it's only back to me. Okay, so um, let's assume I would like to share some content. So for example, uh, somebody is sharing a whiteboard. I uh, start a new whiteboard from the device uh, to my right. The whiteboard is also appearing on my Apple Vision Pro and then I can go
go ahead and start painting a person here on the whiteboard okay that's done and <laughs> I still have my audience like hoovering in the middle of the room um, and I also have the possibility to basically choose a color so let's say I would like to use blue to like draw a person here there we go the eye a little nicer and with yellow I draw the hair of this person here it somehow feels that my finger gets a little colder when I put it in the white inside the white whiteboard and I see the result here and this uh, person has also curly hair like me and is showing up on the whiteboard of the Apple Vision Pro as well so all in all pretty cool pretty amazing what can be done so um, I still have my participants and because it is so much fun I would also in the middle of the whiteboard session I would like to pop that person out as well so this person is now basically in front of my camera I have it, him a little bit bigger and I would like to close the whiteboard then it is closed for everyone and go back to the grid view and there we go we have the grid view back to where it was let's have a quick look at the other options we have we have the recording which is running at the moment we have the participants which we can mute or unmute as we please um, we have closed captions we saw oh slido polls as well so we have a, a slido option um, as well so we can create a slido and just move it to the side here so we can basically see what the, we can manage the slido from here so this one here for example creating a new slido besides the slider we can invite more people and some additional content can be shown here as well call statistics that's somehow of interest for me as well so let's see audio wise we are muted so we don't transmit anything video wise it is quite cool because we have a, a transmit rate of like 300 and 37 kilobits per second and we receive more than six megabits or so almost seven and I guess this is caused by the people in the audience which are shown in quite good quality so I can move over here to talk more to this person or over here so when I am running when I'm running a presentation I can basically walk back and forth and still keep talking to the various people in the room and they feel like literally being in the room here with me um, yes so let's yeah we see that the bitrate also went up to 12 megabits per second because I guess I was like looking at them more uh, directly so they are showing also in a better quality um, there we go that was the call statistics and by the way we can also besides besides uh, y using the menu like this we can we can also uh, press the button so the, the one option is to just look at the menu and then click with the fingers on it like I did here or I can actually press the person and see like for example the people's inside option which is then going here and I can close it again so this is both options are available yes I can also make it smaller so I can focus more on what's what's happening here so all in all very exciting um, I enjoy this experience a lot uh, let's see how it, how it evolves what possibilities there are going to be with this but I think it's a completely new 
experience compared to to what we had earlier so it opens up new possibilities i'm gonna end this meeting now end it for all and uh, also stop the recording that was it with the with the possibilities we have here thank you very much for watching it i hope it helped it hope i hope it helped to get like a, an idea on what is possible these days with the apple vision pro and webex and i hope to see you in my next video thank you very much and goodbye